I'm still alive. Can you believe that? <laughs> uh, I want to, um, I just thought about making this video because um, I, I still have not, um, ah, you know, it's so, so nice that box. It's still so, so with the plastic around it and <laughs> so, so untouched, you know. Um, but I will unbox. I have two mega fragrances now to unbox though. So, but uh, I want to quickly talk about the house Tiziana Terenzi. You know, uh, I got two samples of this house. Um, one I thought is so good that it's al already empty. Uh, but that's the second one I'm going to talk about. The, f the first one I'm going to talk about is called Kirke. Um, K-I-R-K-E. E and something weird on top of it, uh, an accent aigu or something like that. So this fragrance, I mean, holy shit, holy shit. I mean, uh, I've <sighs> just for you, just for you. I will do this now. Here it is. Here is it. Here it is. It has no, unfortunately, it was sampled by the perfumer house. So, uh, by, uh, and so it's not labeled, but you will, I hope you believe me. Why would I lie to you? I will also not say anything you m wouldn't have heard already, maybe. Uh, I just have to be careful here. It's one of those dripping ones. Oh my God. Ooh, wow. Shit. That was much. That was too much. Oh no. <laughs> big fail it's the wrong one it's the wrong one okay that is a big fail okay okay let's still do it <laughs> oh, that was terrible oh shit i am so sorry i'm so stupid so that is the right one oh god i'm gonna ooh, so much again Oh my God! Yes. Oh, how can you mistake in that? So, um, wow, yo, uh, yo, <laughs> yo. So let me let me tell you something. Kirke. That stuff smells so cheap. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Tiziana Terenzi. Uh, I will make it up with the other fragrance after this video, after this uh, fragrance here. But this one here, damn, it stinks. And you know, how, uh, after what it stinks? After cheap women's shampoo, like like a peachy, a peachy women's shampoo. Uh, or, I don't know, some shampoo you also sometimes use when it has, uh, when manly ones, when they have like... Um, like some fruit notes in it. Whoa, it is really like that hair hair washing equipment stuff. And I just don't like it at all. Like um, I have seen a thread on a website where someone said, is this wearable for a woman? For a, man, <laughs> for a woman. Is this wearable for a man? <sighs> Fuck. I don't think this is even wearable for a woman. That's so... <sighs> so so too much like it's so too much it's just it's so synthetic no i don't know if it's synthetic but it smells very bad in my opinion so that's a hard pass for me i will never buy this fragrance gosh no 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 and okay let's stop the rant here and you know cien s y e n e was in here it's empty but i hope the thing is still smelling after it Barely, unfortunately. But Sien, that is an amazing fragrance. That is a super amazing fragrance. It smells like a... To me, to my nose, it was always smelling like a super, 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 super monster high quality version of Le Mal. So if you if you think Reflection Man is your high, high end Le Mal, try Sien by uh, again s y e n e 
uh, by Tizian Terenzi and don't expect it to have that typical Lemal vibe necessarily but it just reminded me personally a lot to Lemal so it might be for you different that you say no I don't smell the uh, Lemal at all but for me it was but that was not the reason why I loved it so much I just love it because it was so freaking awesome uh, I, I've read I couldn't distinguish the notes again like freaking hell how do you do this I don't get it I think I have to learn something about this because it gets like, kind of embarrassing for me at this point but it had has like big notes of honey and musk it seems like yeah okay the honey probably makes that sweetness but just overall it's such a great fragrance a must try in my opinion for you people so um, also, you have to try Kirke and tell me what do you think about that. If you love it, that would be very cool. Please tell me why you love it then, because I'm very curious about that then, because I cannot stand it. Whoa, it's, it, it doesn't change. It, it's still, it's that women's shampoo. It's not good for me. It's not good for me. <laughs> I don't know. So I, that was my video about the two fragrances of Tiziano Terenzi. Um... I know they also have an Aventus clone, Orion. I don't like it. Uh, I don't like that clone of Aventus. Uh, it was too grass, too grassy, too green for my nose. Like it was the same direction, like Royal Vintage went, or also a Morning Chess by that fragrance company. I cannot recall right now. And they all go in that direction that I don't like too much, like a green note to it, to that pineapple and that musk and that incredibly incredible vibe of Aventus back in the days when it was good. However, I hope you have a great evening, even though it's a Monday. And stay safe, stay tuned, and I love you guys so much. <laughs>